How's it going, guys? This is MTX86, and I am not on my Ninja 300. I am currently riding Jolly Rod Radiates Yamaha R6. For the first, you'll say, real time, I took it around the parking lot once. I gotta say, this shit is crazy. I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, oh. A little more sensitive than I'm used to. Say the uh, the riding position is actually quite interesting. It's you know how it's like a the super sport's got like a slouch position versus my standard position on the Ninja 300. It's actually more comfortable than I expected it to be though. And well, then there's the uh, the power bit. I'm gonna go find a spot where I can. I don't want to sit kind of down about in the most respectful way possible. I'm sure Jolly Rogers watching this video. I'm sure of it. It feels so different. The turning radius is, he told me that too. Uh, the, the words of the wise that he gave me before I went out on it is, you better not fucking drop my bike, is one. <laughs> and number two, uh, to watch out for the turning radius because the handlebars are at such an angle. This thing sounds so awesome. Oh my dear lord. That was not, like, I didn't give it any throttle there. This thing's ridiculous. I've got another friend waiting for me right now. We're supposed to go for uh, some chicken wings. Believe it or not, it's like 5 o'clock p.m. right now. It's so bright out. And I was like, I don't, I don't care. I'm sorry, man. Like, good buddy, I can't. I love chicken wings, but I need to take this thing out. So he's waiting for me at the restaurant right now. <laughs> I bet you don't care. Oh, some gravel. We don't want that. Oh, neutral mode. To be honest, though, I, I'm, I'm, this is kind of a test for me, too, because I've never actually ridden another bike other than my own. And I actually feel pretty comfortable right now. Mind you, I'm not exactly on twisties. comments like, oh, we're going to ride an R6, ride an R6. you got to keep in mind that you've got to respect the fact that it's not mine. Ridiculous. 
I don't care that I'm lost. Maybe we'll turn around. Oh yeah, that's exactly where I need to be, is gravel. That's how you get a lot of YouTube views, eh? Ninja 300 Rider crashes R6. My bike, I can't ride around like this in first gear. Yeah. I'm sorry, babe, I'm getting a 636 next. <laughs> My fiance, uh, she's supportive. You know, she's good with whatever kind of bike I get, but she's nervous. And after I took this thing up for a spin um, in the parking lot, I told him like, "Oh my God!" Like it was just in the parking lot. And I'm like, "I want to. I, I kind of want a 636 next." And she's like, "No," in the most loving way possible. That's how she sounds, dude. It's cute. Just like, I have no idea where I am right now. I, I just need to be on a straight road. Like a non-suburban road. Pretty soon he's going to be sweating like, oh, <laughs> where is he with my bike? And if I could talk to him, I'd be like, I don't know. to this folks. So it's actually in like phenomenal. I don't remember what year it is. I think it's like a 2002 or something but it's in really good shape too. Outstanding shape. <laughs> Let's hope it's in the same shape by the time I'm done with it, eh? to this bike is that I'm used to going up a gear, down a gear, up a gear, down a gear. This R6 just doesn't care. Oh, you want to go 101st? Sure. Let's do that. No problem. I did it. I do it again. Uh, yeah. It's like 3,000 RPM. All right, guys. Well, this concludes my test run. Tell me what you think. Okay, bye. I'm shaking my head because this thing's ridiculous. I can't imagine people on motorbikes. 